2.5% is what OSHA recommends as safe. Anything below that is considered unsafe. Uh, this unit will beep if the oxygen level drops below that. Right now you can see it's uh, at 20.9, so it's above safe levels. And we're going to bring in our first student because, of course, they... Uh, the public health experts are recommending that we that we have you can come in that we have uh, our stu our students wear masks. So we're going to take the GX 2009. We're going to put it up inside the mask and uh, just have our uh, our student breathe normally here and see if it starts to. Okay, you can see that this started to beep right away. Let me see if I can show the uh, percentage here. 17.1 is what it shows. Let me see if I can get that peak. Okay, there it is. It actually was lower than that at 17.0. So we're again, 19.5, and you can see how quickly uh, that was. Thank you. We're going to bring in student number two. Let me clear the peak on this uh, because this does uh, have a memory, so I'm just going to hold near uh, where you breathe there, and we'll see what happens. Again, nope, oh, okay, there we go. Almost immediately from breathing, it's sensing. Okay, thank you. Now let me get to the peak uh, screen where it has the memory on it. Okay, there's the peak of 18.1. So almost immediately, this is dropping below uh, what is considered safe by OSHA. And now we're gonna bring in our third mask our third student with a different type of mask. This is just your standard surgical mask. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just trying to clear this because I want to make sure everybody knows. So the peak now is 20.9. We're back uh, clear. Let me get back to the reading screen. Okay, now it's in active reading mode at 20.9 as well. And then if you would do the same thing, uh, we're going to have student number three here just put it up under his mask. And just try to put the mask back as best. Okay. Um, thank you. All right. And we're showing in the 17s here. I'm going to try to turn the alarm off and go to the peak screen. Okay, that one, 17.6. So as you can see, uh, the 19.5 is what OSHA considers the danger level. And on all three of the tests, we did a straight surgical mask. We did an N95 mask, and we did a very thin mask of the first student. Uh, can you hand me that? I just want to show how thin that mask is. Yeah, the gray one there. That's great. I mean, this is this is basically, this was the first one. Uh, this is very thin material, and it's still trapping uh, and lowering the oxygen level. Uh, again, GX2009, made by RKI Industries. Anybody can do this test. Uh, almost instantly, the oxygen levels drop below the danger zone.